Hey, Big Rich here. Some more iPhone, iPad help. So today we're going to take you through notifications and the notifications menu in different apps and, and how you can change notifications and the settings. Hope that helps, Mom. She always wonders what those red dots are on the app, so this might give her a little clue as to what they mean. Notifications are all over your phone and you can control notifications for the different apps. So apps use notifications to give you a heads up to what's going on. So notifications come down from the top. These are notifications that are turned on for the different apps that I have. Notifications are the little red icons that you see for things to do. So I'm sure I have lots. These are my apps and the little red things. Those little bubbles are notifications. I have 35 to do's. I have a new Instagram. I got a note of ways. Somebody snapped Snapchat to me and I have 44 emails to look at. So you can turn on those notifications. When you get a new notification in, you can have it drop down from the top of your screen. Um, you can have a notification show on the lock screen. So let's just go through a quick settings on notifications. You might want to turn them on and off for whatever reason. And we'll quickly look at the settings. So again, look for the settings app. It's the little icon uh, that shows up. We'll touch on that. And towards the top, if you're down too low, scroll back up to the top and look for notifications. Oops, hit the wrong one there. Notifications. And you can see for all the different apps, you can change and set notifications. So we're in the notifications menu and you can decide, do you want to show notifications on the lock screen or not? So you go into settings here, always, when locked, or never. I have it turned on to always to see notifications. And then you can go into each of the apps on your phone and set notifications. So let's just go down and talk about messages here, because that's a good one, right? And we'll just select one of these icons. So four messages, right? So this is texting on your phone. Do you want to allow notifications or not? So you can turn them all off if you'd like or turn them back on. You can decide the sound for the notification and change the sound and what it's like. So hello if you want, aura, or none. You can decide if it's going to vibrate or not vibrate. And messages I have set on vibrate only and no sound. So I'm going to go back to the note for default. And again, you'll see now that it's on for both sound and badges. And then you can scroll a little further and say badge app icon. That's that little red bullet on the screen. Do you want to see it or not? That turns off the badge app icon. So there won't be a little red bullet with the number of messages that you have. Do you want to show this in CarPlay? So again, if you connect to CarPlay in your car, you can turn it on and off in CarPlay if you'd like. Where do you see alerts? Lock screen, show history. Again, there's different ways to show banners. So I have banners turned off. You can see the options go away. I, don't, I no longer see it in the screen. I turn banners back on. And do I want them to be persistent, meaning they're going to show on the screen and not go away until I do something? Or they come on and just temporarily come on. Right now I have them coming on temporarily. They drop down for a second and go back up from the top. Okay. So for you can imagine you could spend a lot of time for all these applications to turn notifications on and off. Play with it. Go into each of the apps. Decide what you want to do. My guess is you'll want a different level of notifications for each of the apps that you have. You also notice at the bottom you can turn off Amber Alerts or Emergency Alerts. I, I know at work or in the house, it's, it's kind of funny, but everybody has Amber Alerts turned on. Matter of fact, one went off on my phone this morning. Um, and you just hear buzzing going everywhere. So back out, Notifications, under Settings. Let's go back out again. I'll show you how to get in. Settings, Notifications, and set up notifications for each of the apps on your iPhone or your iPad, right? It works the same. So that's notifications. Hopefully you're a little clearer and you'll be notified in the future. That's The Sitch with Big Rich. Make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel. 
Watch all my past videos and all the new information coming your way.